Early metaverse figures have shown that uh, UK is set to see the driest September since records have begun back in 1910. We've seen an average of just 19.4 millimetres of rain across the UK, which is merely just 20% of a typical average September. So the map on the left shows um, the percentage of rainfall compared to a typical uh, period of between 1981 and 2010. And the browns and the dark browns show just quite how dry it's been across the UK. And in Northern Ireland in particular, it's been especially dry here with just 7% of what we'd normally see in a typical September. As well as the very dry conditions, it's also been particularly warm as well, both by day and by night. And the map on the right shows the mean temperature. So that shows here that across the UK, it's been drier and warmer than what we'd typically expect. That shows by the, the reds and the pink colours across the map. But it hasn't been a record breaker. 2006 was actually a warmer September. But it has been so far this year, the fourth warmest September since records have begun back in 1910. So what's caused all this fine weather across the UK? High pressure has stayed firmly in control of the UK's weather and this brings generally dry, fine and sunny settled conditions across the country. At the same time it tends to block low pressure systems that bring in wind and rain from the Atlantic and that's why rainfall totals have been so low. However, if we look at the picture of across the UK from January to August, this has actually been the wettest period since records begun and that's been mainly because the exceptionally wet winter we saw. So for the final stats for September, do check out the Metaverse website at the start of October.